As I was driving here today, I, I turned on Braddock Road, and then I came back on another Braddock Road. Then I passed this, it was a little bridge. Everybody knows the little bridge that's over there to the left? Okay, this is what I want you to remember. Sally, and I asked you to remember Sally. Sally could not what? Read. Sally could not read. Sally was a mule, ladies and gentlemen. Sally the mule could not read. Sally the mule could not read, and on this little bridge, similar to the bridge I saw coming in, it was very weak with a sign that said, bridge weak, do not cross. Sally the mule, who couldn't read, all right, decided to cross the bridge. And you know what happened? She fell in the deep, deep hole. It was, this bridge was covering a hole that had to be 25 feet deep. Poor Sally, ladies and gentlemen, Sally the mule has what? Fallen into the hole. In this little town, in this little town, people came from all around to try to help Sally get out of this hole. All right, the farmers came and they, they tried to get the little dolly to pull her out. You know, poor Sally. Sally was stuck in the hole. And after about a day, a day and a half, si Sally got tired of just standing up. They couldn't get her out. Sally the mule on day two decided to just lay down. Everyone was saying, poor Sally, Sally the mule. On the third day, after the water started creating mud, Sally didn't only lay down, but Sally laid down and she started to like fall asleep. People on the outside looked at Sally and said, oh my goodness, three days, there's no way we can get her out. Sally the mule was in the hole and she looked like she was dead. Poor Sally the mule, it was a very popular mule. But Sally was in the hole, the kids came by and said, Daddy, Mommy, can you help Sally? No, you can't help Sally. So what did they do, all right? They started to cover her up. The farmers came, they had their shovels. Each person took a shovel, covered up Sally. Sally was laying there, half dead, all right? But as the dirt started coming down, ladies and gentlemen, the dirt started coming down, Sally started to wake up a little bit. The people around didn't know what was going on, so they continued to take the dirt to cover up Sally. All right, Sally would do what? Sally would, would, would get up a little bit, all right? And then as the dirt started coming down, Sally started to do what? You gotta work with me, ladies and gentlemen. Okay, the dirt came down, Sally started. They kept throwing the dirt in, and as the dirt came on Sally, Sally would what? Get up. All right, it started coming down, she started to do what? And then what? Get up. All right, she stepped up and was shaking off the dirt, and before you knew it, the dirt started to rise, and Sally did what? She walked out of the hole, ladies and gentlemen. This is, the message from this story is, listen, when things get tough, ladies and gentlemen, you may feel like Sally. When things get tough, you need to do what? You got to shake it off and do what? Step up. Listen, you're going to have some obstacles in your way. It's not going to be easy, but you must think about Sally the Mule, and you're going to do what? Step up. Ladies and gentlemen, if you give your best shot in the interview and you don't get the job, all right, you got to do what? Shake it off and step up. To get a job, ladies and gentlemen, you can't just go on one interview, all right, send out one application. You got to send that electronic portfolio all over the place. It's made for that, ladies and gentlemen. If you ask, now when you get out of this place, you're going to want to get out and you're going to ask a nice young lady. You're at a club, you're chilling. You want to ask the young lady, uh, do you want to dance? You're going to come up to her and say, would you like to dance? And she's going to say what? No. no. <laughs> and you're going to do what? Shake it off. And you're going to step over to another young lady. Now, please, please work with me, ladies and gentlemen. Please work with me. And we're almost done. Two minutes and we'll be done. All right? Now, remember the hand gestures. I need everybody to be involved with this piece right here. I, I will. You will practice good habits every day. I have 
a plan each day. You can have patience. 